Uh, hello, everyone. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, it's always wonderful to come back to Korea. We love seeing all of you. Thank you. Thank you so much, always, for the warm welcome. And uh, it's quite wonderful to be here. This theater is absolutely beautiful. I love this screen. And Chris and I got to watch the movie here last night up there. Uh, it, was, it was really wonderful. So thank you for being here. And it's been a great stay. Thank you. I love you, too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. 우선 감독님께 먼저 질문 드릴게요. 2013년 쟁리처 때도 오셨었고 벌써 한국은 세 번째 오신 걸로 알고 있는데요. 한국을 그 방문하신 소감, 세 번째 방문하신 소감 먼저 여쭤보겠습니다. Uh, it's wonderful. Every time we come here, we get a wonderful warm reception uh, from, the, from the minute we land until the minute we leave. It's just, it's really wonderful. And we, we love this country. 예, 톰 크루즈는 이번이 벌써 일곱 번째 한국 방문이시죠. 2년 만에 다시 방문했는데 이번에 어떤 감회이신지 궁금한데요. Uh, you know, I love it here. Yesterday was so much fun. Uh, everyone coming out and having the opportunity to talk with, you know, the people who showed up. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Thank you. I, I, I just, I absolutely love it here. And you know, this is my seventh visit and my third with Chris, and I absolutely love it. I love your country, and I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. Thank you, man. Thank you. How much I appreciate the warm welcome. I, I never want to leave when I get here, and I can't wait to get back. So thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> it means a lot to me. These moments, you know, the places I grew up, you know, when I was a little kid, I always dreamed of traveling and coming to places like this and traveling to Korea. And it's something that I never, ever take for granted. So thank you so much. Tom Cruise, Yeah, probably taking a vacation. Because in the film, we see you hanging off of an airplane. There yes. obviously doesn't seem to be anything that's impossible for you. Taking a vacation. That's, that's the hard thing. <laughs> no, yeah, but I love what I do. So it's, it feels like a vacation making them. They're incredibly challenging. And I, I love a great challenge. And I love making movies with this man right here. He's an extraordinary friend and I, I think he's just an extraordinary filmmaker and it's it's been a tremendous joy for me this is our fifth film together and uh, I feel very grateful and I love it thank you thank you my friend but I, ha I have to say each one like when he suggested going on the a400 um, I was joking. But often, when you are a friend, especially if you are a soldier, when you are a medal, you are like, the director said, I'm sorry, I'm not a fool. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize that. So that's how that scene was born. And that's how that scene was born. Yeah, that's how that scene, and I remember being kind of going down the runway and thinking, Maybe this wasn't such a great idea. <laughs> Again, I was joking. <laughs> but with this one, we ended up doing that eight times. And also with the underwater sequence, that was very challenging, too. And uh, there were moments that I thought, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> and the motorcycle on the highway. <laughs> and the car. There are those moments you're thinking, Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> 정말 주기 잘 맞는 감독과 배우인 것 같은데요. 관련된 질문 조금 더 드리는 게 좋을 것 같아요. 탐이 이렇게 위험한 액션 씬을 찍을 때 감독님 무슨 생각하면서 보고 계시나요? Because your friends doing it. Um, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. But there, there are a few, there are a few ideas that are that are Tom's idea, uh, like smashing through the glass. And uh, when we're about to do something like that, I, I, I walk up to Tom and say, remember, you wanted to do this. That's a line from Jack Reacher. Yes. Remember, you wanted <laughs> you, this. Remember, you asked for this with everything. <laughs> but if you see, uh, the first film that Chris directed me in was Jack Reacher. And in that movie, there was no car. They, like we had, it was a line, a car chase. And we ended up working and we put it in. And every day we were there, we had the bones of it, but we were really 
ad-libbing the car chase as we were going along. And, and I think well, I, both of us are very proud of that, that car chase. It works perfectly for Jack Reacher, but we always talked about mission and saying, okay, how do we now, you know, with this kind of budget and this kind of location, how do we push it to the next level? And we are very excited to do that. And that's what you see in Mission Impossible. It is the next level of what we learned on the Jack Reacher car chase to push to this one with the car chase and then the added bonus of the motorcycle chase, which, you know, when we were doing it, I, I remember the audience to have, feel that vulnerability for the character on the motorcycle, one that I feel when I'm doing it. 네, 톰 크루즈 배우께 조금 더 여쭤볼게요. 액션 영화를 위해서 평소에 몸 관리를 어떻게 하시는지 좀 비법을 알려주세요. You know, it's, it's interesting because I'm also producing the films and normally when I'm... Who asked that question, by the way? 누가 질문하신 거죠? 이 질문? Yeah, F열 29번 관객님. F열 29번. Hi. Hello. Stand up, please. Hi. How are you? Hello. Um, you know, I've been an athlete my whole life and trained my whole life. Uh, and now I get to train with these, you know, like Wade Eastwood, who's a stunt guy and a lot of great athletes. And I, I, I'm constantly someone who wants to push my skills and learn more and more. I'm very, I look at myself very much as a student of, of life, a student of my profession. And I'm constantly trying to work to gain to become more competent in different areas. So, and I also, I don't, with the workload, we generally don't sleep very much. So I just, I just take very good care of myself. Uh, and just, I train, and I train very specifically for things, but I have my whole life. Um, and I've gotten better at being very efficient with how I prepare for things. Mission Impossible 2 series is always going to be the same. Yeah, 20, that'd be good. I plan on doing it at least till I'm 90. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see how that goes. I'll be, I'll be in a wheelchair then. <laughs> <laughs> he will still be running. I will be in a wheelchair. 별명이 백만 불짜리 미소라고 한국의 모든 관객들이 부릅니다. 당신의 그 백만 불짜리 미소를 관객분들 위해서 한 번만 보여주실 수 있으실까요? 네, M 열 6번 관객분 뒤에서 질문해 주셨습니다. <laughs> Just to say thank you all so much for being here and for watching the film and for always welcoming us here. We really appreciate it. We love you all. And I, this is my seventh visit. And as I said, I never take it for granted. We just finished this film about 11 days ago. And being here is, it's like a dream for us. And I love you all, and I thank you always for your warm welcome, and I'll never forget this, and thank you very much. And this is not, this is not goodbye, this is until we meet again. And I will be on the... And I promise you, as always, we'll be on the set and working to make the best films for you, and I hope you enjoy them, because I do, we do, make them for you, and thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah,